Well, hello everybody, this is the Junkyard Messiah again on the Quest for Cut! Alright, so here are round two. Uh, I want to see if we can get this thing working. So I'm going to go th through this and show you what I'm doing and what I've been told to do, and uh, we'll see what happens. The first thing you're going to notice, unlike our previous video, we are not 100% speed, 100% power. We have no file loaded in the machine whatsoever. Our machine has datum into the corner, and we have a piece in the center of the uh, table right at the moment. Now the total work area for this uh, system is 1200 by 900. I went ahead and made changes in the actual machine settings that are uh, 1199.9 and 899.9 respectively for the size. So let's go ahead and take a moment here and take a look at what we're going to do. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is go to layer sets and I'm going to go ahead and make sure that everything is set properly. Uh, right now we have a cut power of 100, excuse me, yeah, cut power of 100 and a speed of 10. Which is more than enough than what we need to do, but what we're going to do is we're going to change that here to a power of 60 and a speed of 10, which is more than enough to be able to uh, uh, handle this. So, here again, we are now at a cut power of 60 and a speed of 10. We're going to leave the corner power at 90 and click OK. All right, so we've gotten that set up. So, what are we going to do next? Well, we are going to go to standalone, and I was told to go ahead and download config. Well, all right, let's go ahead and do that. Download configuration file, yes. I'm just going to do a bunch of calculations, and the machine beeps. It goes beep. So it says no. It says we have a file config. Huh. So am I supposed to cut from this file? I don't think so, but let's find out. So what I'm going to do next, I'm going to move the, move the head into position. Now that's something I've noticed right off the bat. This thing is a lot faster now. It's moving real fast. Scary fast. I kind of like the slower speed, but okay. We've done our config. This piece should work from the uh, center out. And start. Nothing. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and date them back. Date them back. Nothing. Nothing's happening. Still control, even though it's very wild, very fast. Alright. So nothing happened, but we've uploaded the config file? Okay. We've uploaded the config file. So what's our next step? Well, uh, perhaps we need to download current into the machine. Calculations. All right. So we've downloaded current to the machine, I think. The config file up. Well, what would happen if I press start again? Well, it cuts, but what speeds are cutting at? A hundred percent. What powers are cutting yet? A hundred percent. No change. Hmm. Let's escape here. Well, that's because the only thing that didn't change was it said config, but actually it loaded graphic one. Okay. So maybe I did this backwards. 
let's try something a little bit different here. Let's go ahead and delete this. Alright, uh, delete it. We're empty now. Okay. Then we'll escape. We're going to go ahead and date him back home. Mm, I don't like that speed, but it did date him home properly. Alright. So, what I'm going to do next is delete all here. And I'm going to hit download current first. And then I'm going to download config. Download config file, yes. Alrighty. So it says config. Again. So if I hit start here, should it run? Let's find out. Interesting. This time we got a soft stop. because that it's uh, set all the way home. Keep in mind, it did go a millimeter or two under. Maybe I need to go further under. But for the moment, let's go ahead and move this into position. Again, now it says graphic one again. Start and and once again we're drawing a big circle. This is again supposed to be a five millimeter circle, a five centimeter circle, five hundred fifty millimeter circle. So we're doing one hundred percent speed, one hundred percent power. And still no joy. Right. Okay, I'm at a loss. So what do I do next? Um, we could try a couple other things. Um, I don't know. I'm going to have you guys look at this and tell me what you think. What am I doing wrong? It should be obvious. Alright. Um, I guess the only other thing I can think of doing right now is try to launch it from the computer instead of launching it from start run. So again, we're going to go back and we're going to delete our file. File is deleted. Now I am noticing that this thing is a lot faster since we have uploaded the config file. So what does that tell us? Something has changed. So why isn't it working? My scale is correct on both the little picture and here in the millimeter range. So I have no idea why my sizing is wrong. But the big thing is, is that why is this thing running away in speed and power? Let's go back over to layer here. Perhaps I need to start it from this. Let's go back to standalone again and delete all. And download the config file. Download the config. Okay. Config file has been loaded. Perhaps I need to start from here for it to work. Let's find out. Nothing happens. 
well now. You sat through this first 10 minutes of this, and as you can obviously see, it's not working. Um, okay. I'll go ahead and do one more try at this. Uh, this time I'm going to change my speed from 10 to 5. So it should operate only at half the speed that it previously did. Maybe click OK. We'll go back over here and we'll delete the config file. Just in case we need to reload the config file with a new, sh new change. File has been deleted. I'm back over here. Download config file. Beep. There's a config. Download current. Now what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go ahead and export my config file. Let's find out what happens, and I'm, I'm not hopeful here. So we come back over here, it says config, but I'm willing to bet you if I hit escape, it's going to say graphic one. And I bet if I hit start, either from there or here, what's it going to do? Something different. At least I think so. It is definitely going slower than it did. As in if it was going 50% of its power. Or 50% of its speed, excuse me. Interesting, but at a, f a normal five speed, it goes a lot slower than that. All right, guys. So we've had an interesting. We had had a small success. It looks like we're running. I'm consumed that we can we're running their power and we're running our speed now from the from the config file. So why is it so radically different from the settings that are here? Because normally five speed in this would be creeping along very slowly. Well, gentlemen, um, take a look at this video and tell me what you think. And also, if you have any suggestions on why my five centimeter circle is now a 12 centimeter circle, and how I can adjust that. Again, I'm sorry to take up all your time here. I hope you guys can help me. Because um, I plan to do some really, really cool stuff off of this machine. It's just been a real bear trying to figure it all out. And here I've got a CNC machine downstairs that I can run with my eyes closed. Alright, thank you very much and I hope to hear from you. Have a good day.